Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I have my best friend Foyan and we're gonna have a little bit of a girl talk with a get ready with us. So yeah, let me tell you a little bit more about Foyan. Foyan and I have been friends for like how many years? Seven? Eight? Eight? Almost not. What? Oh we God. were like 14, 15 and we're like 23-ish now. So, so it's, it's been, been like eight years it's been a of friendship. While. Yeah. yeah, so Foyan and I, we've been through like the most together. We started on the Seventeen Magazine Style Council, if any of you guys are old enough to remember that. Wow, yeah, we so like back way back when. Way but back. I thought that I'd have her on my channel, it's by time that you guys got to meet my best Properly. And also we thought we'd do something like a girl talk because we are like the best people to do a girl talk and like, like we just know everything about exactly everything. about everything about we're everything. just so knowledgeable <laughs> like you want to know what we have got to say exactly plus i was just like you know what i actually i probably feel the most comfortable with foyan because she knows me for so long so we can talk about anything and everything and friendships and relationships and yeah like anxiety and like other issues like, and things like everything that everything because and also makeup like yeah we both do makeup like yeah, so if you want to see how we got these looks and also learn some valuable relationship advice and friendship advice and self care, keep, and just watching. keep watching. Okay, let's let's delve into some stuff while while I'm priming my face. I'm gonna use the Essence Fresh and Fit Awake Primer, the Essence Fresh and Fit Primer. I really like the glowiness of this primer. And I'm gonna be using this Woolworths Smoothing Face Primer. It's in Can packaging, it? so it doesn't look great. Have you used it before? I have. I had another one. This is actually a new one. That's why it's still in packaging. Oh, okay. Um, it's very similar to the Maybelline Baby Skin. Oh. So it's like that type I've of like use the Maybelline baby silicone skin. type pore Do you actually filling find one. that it works? It does. It gives you a very nice like mattifying, like smooth base, especially because like especially in my T zone, I have a lot of texture. Mm. So it does help make everything smooth, and it's just nice to put on. Let's actually, like, why I was like, I want to have this, like, get ready with me chit chat video with Foyen is because, like, Foyen has known me probably one of the, lo like, lo the longest? Okay, not the longest, when, but, like, how old she's been consistently you? with me Since through like most 14, of the things. 15, we've known each other. Yeah, we and 14, because 15. it was, like, from that age, and then, like, we went to study together and whatever, like, Foyen's, like, been with me. We've been through it. Through everything, she's been with me, like with my scholarship. Like we've been, we've been doing the things um, through all of the phases of all of the mix. phases of, of life, and we saw Archer like close as hell. I'm yeah. first gonna carve out my brows with a concealer, mm. and then I'm gonna be using the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop concealers. Do you know what I realized? The shade that I got from you is too dark. Let's see if my oh, I'm using the Mac. Paint pot in soft ochre. I love this paint pot. It's like one of my faves. I know it from Nikki tutorials because she used to like live. I and literally swear love by it. it. I have the P Louise and I've been loving it, but I still like how like this is so like it doesn't crease this concealer at all. But anyway, let's jump into the actual like discussion. So for you, let's actually just backtrack a bit and let's chat about the journey of relationships. <laughs> Oh gosh, I never ever ever speak about this kind of thing on my social media. I don't ever introduce anybody that I'm dating. Oh, hold on. I'm using the Smashbox. What palette is this? LA Cover LA Shot. LA Cover Shot palette. This is a beautiful palette. It's I'm so actually nice. show you guys how beautiful it's palette. And Smashbox is like incredible with the pigment of the eyeshadows. Like there's quite a lot of fallout in this palette, but... It's because they're like the color pigment. Pale. Oh my god. Shook. I'm gonna be using this Makeup Revolution Flawless 4 palette, by what the is way. That palette? I like it. Like it's really cute, got this really cute selection of colours and they're actually like really good and really pigmented. I came out of a relationship not too long ago. I think it was like a month and all, a month and a bit. So like my take is also not really lovey dovey right now. Um <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> so I may just be a little bit like cynical, but cynical, this is why we're together because exactly. it's called balance. Balance, that's what we're here for. My first relationship taught me that everything I thought I wanted is not necessarily what I need. Yeah. Um. So, like, so I was like, he must be X height, mm. and he must have this build, and that's must actually look something like, like that I, I learned from like, you. Like, you told me that like you must look past that because for me, I think because I started like dating and I started dabbling into like 
that kind of thing later than everyone else. Mm. Like, we had to learn it? much later. <laughs> I learned. And when I learned, <laughs> you learned. <laughs> I learned. Because, like, wow, those are the things that actually, like, don't matter. Like, yeah. they do matter, but, like, other things matter more. Yeah, like obviously, like you need. That's you need to be you attracted, need to, be attracted to, someone, to someone, obviously. But it's like how they behave, their values, their yeah. priorities, it, it things like that matter a lot more. It makes attractive over time. Like that, like once you actually get to know the person. So maybe initially you didn't really see them like a super hot or whatever. Yeah. But then when you get to know somebody, it's like when they are really good person, when they kind, when they genuine, it's like their attractiveness kind of just like intensifies. Yes. Because they a good person and like you click well or like you just like vibe well together. And definitely go for good people. Like that's a very like vague thing to say, but like, you know, there's the nice guy, yeah. like the guy who thinks like, oh, but I haven't hit anyone, I haven't cheated. I'm such a nice guy. Why don't girls love me? <laughs> what do we call them? The Ted Mosby. Like. <laughs> And I oop. <laughs> like, those aren't the guys that you want because those are the guys who, like, they're, they're not actually good people. Yeah. They you think want, they are. They think they're good people, and for that reason, the world owes them everything yeah. because they are so good. Just for, like, doing the absolute very yeah. minimum. Okay, so let's just. I'm, I haven't even read this, I'm just picking another one. Okay, question three. For our fifth anniversary, I booked us a surprise local getaway. When we checked in, my hubby looks embarrassed. He couldn't get it up that night. Searching for a credit card bill, I found that he goes to that hotel a lot, but he won't discuss it. Oh my what god, do I cheating! Who, <gasps> child? See, I have been cheated on before. And Same. the way that I found out. Who hasn't though? Like, right? If you haven't blessed you, like, God loves you. Like, you know, I'm kidding. But, like, you are God loves lucky. us all. Yeah. Just You're just lucky. God just has his favorites. <laughs> so, I found out in a woman to woman, actually. But one day, he, I was just minding my own business. I woke up in the morning and I woke up to a like surprise a surprise message. A surprise message. Yeah. And she was just like, oh, Sis, God, your man is trash. Just thought you should know. I'm using the liquid luck. Um, from Switch Beauty, last mm. designer. When I literally got that message, and I was like, cool, shop, thank you so much. She sent me screenshots, she sent me voice notes, like, she sent me receipts. Yeah. And then I was like, thanks so much, and I left and didn't look back, you know? Mm. <laughs> so, I haven't had to go through that confrontation of, like, me being like, are you cheating on me? Yeah. And then it's like, no, I'm not. When I, when I came forward, I had receipts. Yeah. I had facts. You have to be sure. Because mm. then if you're not sure, then you just look really, really like insecure. And that's gonna, it's gonna come back to bite you, you eventually. You look stupid. You look stupid. Let's talk about self-care. Let's talk about self-care. What do you so, do for self-care? What are your ways of self-care? I'll have like those pampers spa days where I'm like, I do a face mask, I do whatever. But that's not really how I fix myself, like when I'm not in a good space or anything. Um, so for me, self care probably like it has to do with literally just taking a day off, and then I'll either like watch CDs or I'll just like I'll just like like I'll get rest. Yeah. I need rest to like rejuvenate myself, and it might not be like rest as in sleep, but it's just like doing nothing. Nothing, literally. Like literally just doing nothing. Cause burnout is real, guys. It really burnout is. is so real, and a face mask helps because I know that when my skin feels bad, I feel bad. Mm. Cause then I'm just like, what am I gonna do? About you know what skin? else I do? I actually do my face. Cause strangely enough, like I find it looking really... good makes me feel yeah. good. Yeah. Putting on a face, cause then it means like I, I can I've made an effort, like yeah. or I've done a mask. It's like I'm taking care literally taking care of myself mm -hmm. okay let's move on to friendships because this is a topic that even if relationships aren't your thing like if you like to friendships are a really important type of relationship exactly like i'm not i'm talking about like not romantic now so yeah like friendships i feel like all of us have experienced different forms of friendship there are things that i've experienced like for example when you know when your friends going through something and they just aren't like do it it's like like obviously you need to be there for them but it's also like they drain you yeah have you have you experienced that like where you actually don't like it doesn't benefit you every time you go and speak to them it's like they're just complaining or they're talking about like everything negative in their life and you don't like you don't feel like the friendship is mutual because yeah. it's like you're just their therapist exactly um well they are like literally like two main options and these are options that i've tried and like done in my life and i don't think either one is better than the next and i don't think either one is wrong it just depends on what's going on mm. so sometimes like it's maybe back away it's not like i'm ghosting you or anything i'm just 
I'm not initiating conversation. I'm not making that active effort because I know that every time I do or every time we go out and stuff, this is what's going to happen. Yeah. So I'll just slowly like just take a step back or like if I can see them complaining on the timeline, oh, my life is such a mess. Everything is so sad. Woe is me again and again and again. I won't ask what's wrong because mm. it's like I know that I can only be there for a friend if I'm at my best. Yeah. And when things like that happen a lot like it really does take a lot out of you and you have to be in a good space in order to listen and help other people yeah. so if i know i'm not in that space i'm not going to offer any help i'm not going to make that effort and, and what I, if that person like keeps on messaging you like the other option is just like plain old communication like hey dude just listen, sit down and be like we actually this, need to have we need a talk. talk because this friendship is not feeling fair right yeah. now you are just unburdening a lot on me and you unburdening onto me has an effect on me and my yeah. mental health and my life i think a lot of people also underestimate actually just sitting down and saying what like the situation is making you feel yeah. because instead of like attacking the person or actually saying like okay you doing this you doing that and whatever whatever make it about how you're feeling you right feeling. now people can't say that your feelings are invalid yeah that's one thing that they can't say because like you can just like start taking a step back because there are friendships that just dissipate it's just their time has run out people yeah. just drift also when you when you do care about that friendship and it's just a season of like intense unburdening and you just can't handle it anymore definitely raise it like bring it up yeah Oh, my, okay, my my final parting wisdom for you, do not try to parting, build. Parting, where are you going? I don't know. I'm like, this is just one of my golden bars. Okay. Spit don't bars. try to build a man. Yes. Tell because me. the builder never gets to live in the house. True. Moses didn't make it to the promised land, but he led the way. So don't be like Moses. Buy your house fully furnished. Like, make sure you are getting the title deed grand. That's what I'm gonna what say. She said. Mm. <laughs> what she said. Okay, so finish our brows. I'm gonna move on now to blush and highlight. I'm using this Essence one. How beautiful! It's like a limited That's so edition. so cute. Look at this, guys. It's so pretty. It's so, so pretty. I'm gonna use. This is a beautiful color, so I'm gonna use some of that in the middle one. I'm just add some color to my cheek. And then, then use this highlighter from Essence from the Good Vibes collection. Same as that. That love one the blush but that looks pretty the highlight i haven't used it yet let's see how good it is i'm using mac cheeky bronze this is the perfect like everyday subtle glow on dark skin like it just mm. looks so pretty and then you just kind of go all over with it just enjoy oh this highlight is pretty well oh, that's so cute it's like pink it's like a pink little pixie dust mm. <laughs> i had to go and buy a new nyx espresso liner this is the best brown liner in the world right but like right now I was using like a stub. <laughs> it was the ghetto. Like I literally yeah. like so I was like, no, let me just and it was the last one in store. So even if I tried to talk myself out of buying stuff, I would have had to buy this. Yeah. A brand new. Like look at that. Look how Yummy. sharp and like beautiful. It oh it's still focused on my face because I'm so pretty. <laughs> oh look how beautiful that pencil is. Mm. Espresso is great for chocolate gals. Can fix any nude lipstick. Is that what you use on, like when you're doing your ombre stuff? Yeah, and then my trick is also to just put it everywhere because this also helps make, obviously your lipstick last longer but like it makes blending easier if it's everywhere. Wow guys, this mascara is actually doing this. What mascara is that? This is the L'Oreal Paris. Well, I've heard about it. Zippo Rage is about that Paradise, far. ecstatic. About that Love range. It. Oh, and I'm using the Revlon HD Ultra Matte Lip Mousse. I love this stuff. Amazing. I use that Amazing. one. It feels really good. Even though I only just use a little bit. I'm gonna be setting my face with Glam Glow Glow Setter and Urban Decay Pollution Protection All Nighter Spray. Oh my gosh, makeup just looks so beautiful. I just me. feel so much better already. I feel healthy. Just look! I makeup can smell just looks through so my good nose. On it. I can like breathe clearly. My oh, eyesight my has gotten better. Like everything, just makeup just makes me feel like that girl. Thanks so much for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that this girl talk was like helpful and helpful. fun and entertaining. Yeah. And yeah. I hope that you guys learned something. And head over to my channel as well because we are Link doing something below. real cool. <laughs> <laughs> that side so that's gonna be really fun and yeah i hope to see you guys soon on this house channel else you'll be, you'll be, be online yeah but that's yeah. true okay cool. <laughs> like comment and subscribe description box below thumbs up <laughs> ring the bell all of the things bye